Hey, what's going on, guys? Oh, it's been quite a long time, actually. <laughs> uh, I want to talk to you guys about something that I have. I'm very surprised is not on YouTube yet. I have a lot of people in uh, on my DeviantArt on my Super Gamer X uh, account, and um, I've looked on YouTube and, stu on YouTube and stuff, and nobody's made a video about this. And on DeviantArt, I'm like I own the Moving Group, and uh, I've always found it kind of hard when you're doing this. I'm sure everyone who's ever made a moving character has done this. Okay, you get your little sprite sheet and crap. And you're like, ah, okay, time to make this awesome moving character. Because I, like, have the best ideas ever. Alright. So, you, like, you start doing, you start doing this. You have one pa uh, paint open and then another. And you do this number, you're just, you zoom in, and by the way, it's just a random picture I found. And you, you zoom in, and you start doing this little number. And you cut, or copy, whatever, paste, and then you kind of like, crop the edges out, you know, and you do this one by one. And then you save it as a bitmap so you can load it into Fighter Factory. Well, you know that takes forever. So I'm very surprised no one has found this yet. I found this while I was doing um, a art of game design project for my course. And I was making a 3D kind of box animation that's spinning. And I had to get the sprites for it and, you know, bake it into an animated GIF. Um, well, I only did six of the, the box sprites and I was like, huh, there's got to be an easier way to do this. And I found it actually after um, about five Google searches. Actually took a, it actually took a little bit to find. It's called the Alfred Sprite Sheet Unpacker. And I'm very surprised this is not popular at all. I mean, come on, moving creators, this would be like the best tool ever. And basically what it does is you can import a sprite sheet, such as the one I just showed you. Make sure it's bitmap, though. For some reason it has trouble reading GIFs. You load in the bitmap, like we got right here, and you just drag and drop it. You drag and drop it. It unpacks it, basically. And look, it has each, like, individual sprite in its own little section, right? Okay. Now, this program isn't perfect. But it works very well. I've tried it on like many different sprite sheets and it works just fine. Um, you go to options, you know, for your move and stuff, and you go to bitmap and you turn off the make background transparent. You update and close. And once you have all this here, you select all your sprites and then you export. And I'm going to export it to my desktop. I'm just going to make a new folder and rename it. Um, Goku sprites, whatever, and I'm gonna put them in there. Okay, did it, and look how easy that was. Cropped, everything's already done, and I when I did this, I thought this was the coolest thing ever. Like, I was like, why does nobody else know about this? And so, um, this is gonna be a video for my DeviantArt and YouTube if anybody else finds this helpful. I'm going to put a uh, download link in the description and probably on the video as an annotation. And, uh, I, th I can't believe no one, I'm, like, still surprised that no one has found this yet. This Alfred Sprite Sheet Unpacker. And I'm pretty sure people are still doing it with paint. And, uh, hopefully this is going to help some people out. I mean, but just look at that. It's perfect, like. I don't see any flaws in it. The only flaw I've ever uh, seen in the program itself was when I tried to open one sprite sheet that was, um, uh, the background was just pure white and there was a bunch of mixed in sprites all bunched up together. And when I went to try to unpack it, it unpacked the whole sheet as one sprite. Like, it, when I went to export it, it was the same thing. Nothing actually even changed. But, anyway. You should really give this a try. Really easy to do. You just drag and drop it. And 
this makes moving and fighter factor stuff much much easier stuff going into paint and extracting each one and um, I know I've not I'm not dead as you can see it's just I've been busy with school and everything and um, I'm probably gonna be uploading League of Legends videos now because I'm really into League of Legends and I already have a ranked team and everything so you're probably gonna be seeing a lot more League of Legends videos from me so uh, look out for that and I probably lost like 99% of my viewers because I haven't uploaded anything but I'm still getting subscribers which is weird anyway I hope this um video helped you out later guys